I don't know about y'all, but we gotta set the shower on cold, so. Taking cold showers. I see y'all in a minute. All right, man, so listen, I just took a cold shower. As y'all saw before, usually when I wake up, I actually like to stretch first before I even hop into the push-up sit-ups and all that. Didn't record that, but that's the first thing I do is I stretch, wake up, you know, get your limbs and everything loose, get the blood flowing. This is how we like to start the day off. After that, I do the 30 push-ups, 30 sit-ups, 30 squats. This really just adds to that blood flow, waking me up, getting my body endorphins a little bit, uh, kicked in. And then I take a cold shower. A lot of people sleep on cold showers, man. Listen, cold showers is great for the skin. Cold showers will really wake you up in the morning. You just feel good. You know, you feel good when you get out. Now, I'm over here at the scene. I'm about to get ready to wash my face, brush my teeth. I'll show y'all what I'm, what I'm working with. So I actually use this right here to brush my teeth. I'm not no brand ambassador or anything like that. I'm just showing y'all what, what I like to use. And then I use this little toner right here. You know, tone my face. Y'all already seen the little face wash right here. You said it, Phil. But yeah, now we'll hop into the next phase and the morning routine after this. I'll catch y'all. Dear Lord, thank you for waking me up this morning, Lord. I just want to say I'm thankful. I'm thankful for being able to wake up. I'm thankful for being alive, breathing. Lord, I ask that you continue to give me the strength to push forward, to navigate through challenges internally and externally, Lord. Lord, I ask that you watch over all of my loved ones, my family, my friends. I ask that you guide them, you protect them. Lord, I ask that you shield them from all negativity. I also ask that you give them strength as well, Lord, to fight any types of challenges they may be facing internally or externally, Lord. Lord, I ask that you bless all of our hearts. You give us the strength and courage to be generous, sympathetic, kind to others. Lord, I know I am not perfect, and I ask that you please forgive me for my sins. In Jesus' name. Amen. 
I am worthy and good enough. I am confident, strong, and determined. I am in full control of my destiny. I will not allow any negative energy corrupt my space. I will strive to become a better person for myself and the people around me. I am worthy and good enough. I am confident, strong, and determined. I am in full control of my destiny. I will not allow any negative energy corrupt my space. I will strive to become a better person for myself and the people around me. I am worthy and good enough. I am confident, strong, and determined. I am in full control of my destiny. I will not allow any negative energy corrupt my space. I will strive to become a better person for myself and the people around me. Okay. Pretty much after I pray y'all and do my positive affirmations as you, as you guys can see, I'm fully dressed now, ran through my push-ups, my sit-ups, my squats, I stretch. Those are the two first things I do before I even jump in the shower. After those two things are finished, I like to take a cold shower. This for me really helps me feel good. I feel like it wakes me up in the morning and it just kind of gets me flowing from the push-ups, sit-ups, and the squats and stretching. At this point, my blood is already flowing a little bit. I honestly feel like the, you know, the cold shower is really just icing on the cake for me. After I'm fully dressed, moisturized, put my do-rag on, obviously I'm not going outside yet. I'm still inside of, you know, my dorm room right now. I'll jump right into what you guys are seeing me do currently. I meditate. After I'm finished meditating, I'll pray, and then I'll do my positive affirmations. And then the last thing to finish all of this off is doing my daily goals. So you guys can see I have a my 2024 planner essentially what i like to do here i'm writing down what i need to do for the day you know i'm setting the intention i'm setting the expectations and i'm keeping myself aligned with what i have set out for myself long term which essentially will be you know my yearly goals and what i'm trying to accomplish for the month this makes it um less taxing for me less overwhelming for me as i navigate through my days because i already wrote it down I already set the intention and at this point I can just simply execute um, and this pretty much tops everything off so um you know if you guys want more videos I mean definitely stay tuned you know I'm definitely gonna come out with some more I was actually contemplating for a little while as far as just trying to figure out what I was gonna put out for the first video um, but I figured why not just show you guys my morning routine I think this is for me personally this is one of the biggest components me being able to wake up and do exactly what I need to do I think that as I continue on with this channel continue on with the content I really just want to broadcast and show you guys you know what goes on in my day-to-day -day as a young up-and-coming entrepreneur and that's honestly really gonna be the goal of this channel right it's just showing you guys what i do specifically as i'm navigating and as i'm on my journey but most importantly i guess the value here and what i would like for everybody to extract from the content I, i'm going to be releasing is just transparency around what it looks like going to an entrepreneur you know there's ups and downs there's good days bad days the reality is everything is not perfect the fact that you know i'm here now on a whole separate channel should be a testament that sometimes you have to scale back and sometimes you have to reevaluate life happens point is is a journey is not a straight line. That's really what I want to broadcast here. Honestly, with the content, I'll be proactive about making sure I'm creative and how I'm delivering you guys value. But most importantly, though, y'all need to come see what's up, man, in, 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 in my life, man. You know, so I guess this is just really all about, you know, Dion Bote, man, up and coming young entrepreneur. I love real estate, finance, and insurance. So a lot of things you guys may hear me speak on or talk about in my core businesses will revolve around that. I'm graduating this May at Westfield State University and I'll be getting my master's right after uh, my undergrad. So um, y'all just stay tuned, man. Y'all just check in and, and be tapped in into the journey. And I hope that you guys find the content that I'll be dropping valuable. I hope this morning routine was valuable. I hope it was inspiring. And I hope that you guys could also implement something into your morning to make sure that you guys are staying in alignment with the goals that you guys have set out for yourselves. So on that note, I'm finna be out. And I'll catch y'all in the next vid, man. So y'all stay tuned. Y'all stay tuned, all right?